Borderlands 2, review, review. Very good, Amog sus. Oh my God, make it stop. Please God, if you take this away from me, I promise I'll never eat two pizzas in one sitting again. And immediately, more among us, there is no God. And if there is, he has abandoned us. I played this game in PC with maximum graphics. It's so beautiful. It's the best game of 2012. Zero out of 10. It's like Borderlands 3, but older. Oh, I get it now. Bussin. Shit bussin. Respectfully. Boardwall Wands. If you don't play this, you can't call yourself a gamer. And the Monster Energy Can Award goes to this review. Shows dangers of dictatorships. Violent games are found all throughout society. Whether you like it or not, your children will be exposed to violence and murder. And if they are 12 plus, they have already been exposed to it. That's honestly probably true. <laughs> the main point that I want to bring up is the plot. The antagonist, Handsome Jack, is a dictator. Subconsciously, your children will learn the horrors of dictatorships and letting unfair authority rise to power. They will also learn when resistance is necessary and when it is not morally correct. All while having fun. Guns plus guns equals funds. See, I knew I could like math if someone just presented it the right way. Has big gun that explodes when no ammo. Good game. The most ridiculously fun way to be a fashionable psychopath without earning prison time. That's the trick, isn't it? Being a psychopath and not going to prison. I only played this game from Borderlands games and I liked it just that. In this game, there are guns and I play this game a lot because I like it. So you like the guns, I, I think is what you say. Recommended, 822 hours on record. It's not bad. Many gun kill many enemy. 10 out of 10, see? More math I can get on board with. Killing stuff is fun. If you love McDonald's, you'll love Borderlands. Overrated bleep, suck my bleep bleep. All right, give me your Mad Libs in the comments. I have no idea what this is. Pew pew, the guns have stats. Reroll for new stuff, more pew pew. Most replayable game ever. With 2,534 hours, yeah, it looks like you replayed it a lot. <laughs> Fucking amazing. Seven out of five, I think that's what that means. Only minus for not having enough hours in a day to play. I totally understand that. I hate when you can only play for like an hour or two at the end of the day. And you're like, no, I need more time. This game is so long. I played this as a child and could not kill the first boss. Now I am the boss. I bought this game thinking it was good because of the ratings on here, but it was terrible. I played for five minutes and started throwing up. I hate how you jump around so high and how crappy the gun system is and why did you throw up? And why did it only take five minutes? I'm so confused. Recommended, 810 hours on record. I've played it a bit, it's good, pretty good. I played it with Greg. Oh, Greg, yeah, he's a good guy. Who the hell is Greg? Borderlands 2 is a shameless loot grind. Sorry, let me rephrase that. Borderlands 2 is an extremely fun, shameless loot grind with great humor, wonderful co-op play, tons of exploration, and wall sphincters. <laughs> I have no idea what the wall sphincters are, but I'm, now I'm interested. Play with friends, my go-to game to shoot the shit while shooting shit. This game is Shooter Diablo, so it is pretty good. <laughs> now I see why you like it, Peter. Shooting and tooting through the biomes. Handsome Jack kicks ass. Didn't they just say he was the bad guy? Although we all love a likable bad guy. Borderlands 2 is a beautiful content-filled game with plenty of intelligent design decisions, interesting characters, and a lot of variety. I normally don't like RPGs, Skyrim included. Okay, stop it. Your opinion is no longer valid to me. Next, Borderlands, more like Snorderlands, am I right? Strawberry cheesecake French toast. Ingredients, four slices bread, four eggs, Hey, wait a minute. Actually, this sounds pretty good. Strawberry cheesecake French toast. I'm, I'm on board. I'm gonna send this to my wife, see if she'll make it for me. Reviewing every game I own, number 25. The fact that I'm willing to put up with some of the worst dialogue and humor in all of gaming is a testament to just how fun this game is. Everyone always talks about this game and how funny it is, so I hope the dialogue's not that bad. Next, we're gonna blow up the ocean. I'm getting real big Zawarudo vibes from this. Recommended, 1,191 hours on record. Tis good. Todd Howard killed my parents. 
I trained my gun skills in BL2 so I may seek revenge. I have yet to find a gun to slag him with. I'll keep you updated though. Please do, I really wanna know where this goes. Very nice, very sexy, and poggers if I do say so myself. Ever wanted to beat the shit out of some psychos with a buzzsaw and a stick? Yeah, me too, this game is for you. What a crap, not easy to play today, ass burning, tiny game with a huge amount of problems. You actually need life hacks and guides if you want to get anything from this game. Six out of 10. Seems like you didn't hate it that much. You shoot, you get loot. You shoot, you get loot. Repeat. That sounds like fun. I give the reviews for Borderlands 2 a seven out of 10. The one about wanting to actually kill someone in real life disturbed me a little bit and that brought your score down, guys. Sorry. Alrighty, click and record in three, two, one, boom. <laughs> I, I, I know you don't need that, but at this point it's just a habit.